In Swanage Bay by Dina Craig. Twas five and forty year ago, just such another morn. The fishermen were on a beach, the reapers in their corn. My tale is true, young gentlemen, as sure as ye were born. My tale's all true, young gentlemen, the fond old boatman cried, unto the sullen angry lads whose vain obedience cried. Mind what your father says to you, and don't go out in this tide. Just such a shiny sea as this, smooth as a pond. You'd say in the white gulls flying, and the craft down the channel making their way, and the Isle of Wight all glittering, bright seen from Swanage Bay. The battery point the race beyond, just as to this, just as today you see. This was, I think, the very stone where sat Dolly, Dick and me. She was our little sister, sirs, a small child just turned three. And Dick was mighty fond of her, though a big lad and bold, he'd carry her like any nurse, almost from birth, I'm told. For mother sick and soon and died, when Dolly was eight months old. We sat and watched a little boat, her name was Trixie Jane. A queer old tub laid up ashore, but we could see her plain. To see her at... To see her not all her up, cost us a dis. To see her not all her up, cost us a deal of pain. Said Dick to me, "Let's have a pull. Father'll never know. He's busy in his wheat up there and cannot see us go. These lands are such a. These lands. These lands are such cowards. The puff of wind up blow. I've been to France and back three times. Who knows best, Dad or me, whether a craft sea worthy or not." Dolly will go to sea. And Dolly laughed and hugged him tight, as pleased as she could be. I don't mean sorry to blame poor Dick. What he did sure I'd do. And many a sail in Trixie Jane. We'd had her when she were new. Father was always sharp, and what he said he meant it too. But nay, the sky had not a cloud. The bay looked smooth as glass. Or Dick could manage any boat, as neat as ever were. And Dolly croaked. And Dolly crowed to me, as neat as ever was. And Dolly crowed, me go to sea, you jolly little lass. Well, sirs, we went a pair of oars, my jacket for a sail, just round old Harry and his wife, those rocks up there with an ale. And we came back, do you want to hear the end of this old man's tale? Oh, yeah, we came back past the point that the breeze up sprung. Dick shouted, oi, down the sail. And pulled with all his might among the white sea horses that upreared, so terrible and strong. I pulled too, I was blind with fear, but I could hear old Dick breath coming and going, as he told Dolly to creep beneath his jacket, and not hold him so. We rode for life or death. We almost reached a sheltered bay. We could see Father standing upon the little jetty here, his sickle in his hand. The house is white, the yellow fields, and the safe and pleasant lands. And Dick, though he was pale as any ghost, had only sighed to me. We're right now, old lad. When up a wave rolled, drenched us free on one lurch, and then I felt the chill and roar of the binding sea. I don't remember much but that, you see. I'm safe and sound. I've been wrecked four times since then. Seen queer sights, I'll be bound. I think folks sleep be for deep, as calm as underground. But Dick and Dolly? Well, poor Dick, I saw him rise and cling unto the gunwale of the boat, float and keel up, and sing out loud, Where's Dolly? I hear him yet, as clear as anything. Where's Dolly? I know the answer made, for she dropped like a stone. Down through the deep sea, and it closed. A little thing was gone. Where's Dolly? Three times then Dick loosed old. The little thing was gone. Where's Dolly? Three times. Then Dick loosed his old and left me there alone. It's five and forty years since then, muttered the boatman grey, and drew his rough hand over his eyes and stared across the bay. Just five and forty years, and not another word did he say. But Dolly asked the children all, as they bowed and stood. Poor Dolly, she floated back next tide with seaweed in her hand. She's buried up over that isle, you see. In the churchyard on the land, but where Dick lies, God knows. He'll find our Dick. But where Dick lies, God knows. 
and we'll find our dick judgment day. The boat went foul and mending nets. The boys ran off to play. And the sun shone and waved and the sun shone and the waves danced in quiet Swanage Bay.